Hey, keep me waiting, what in you kid? All right, I'm to see what you can do. I'm Doug Dimidom. I'm one of the Dimsdale Dimidom, but today my name is Jessica. Let's go, Doug Dimidom. I'm the known as Jessica. Let's go, Doug Dimidom. I'm one of the Dimsdale Dimidom. <laughs> What is up my Hall of Famers, Lee Trainer Hugo here with the next episode of the Pokemon White 2 Randomizer Nuzlocke. How you all doing? I hope you're having a fantastic day. You can definitely tell that my voice is going, so this is not going to be fun. But it is going to be fun, because I just want the fun times to keep rolling. But I want to keep recording, I want to be consistent even though I am unwell. But we're going to keep going. So my voice is going to sound like this for a little bit, I might cough every now and again, but <clears throat> it's okay. We're going to try and do this. Uh, I didn't notice how bad my voice was until I started recording. Because <laughs> I haven't really spoken all day today. It's like 1 o'clock, breaking the fourth wall. It's 1 p.m. You can see it in the down below anyway. But let's have a very quick team recap. I did a grinding montage, but I didn't. Unfortunately, it was corrupted. The file got corrupted. So, unfortunately, we, you won't be able to see it. But I got everyone to level 29 or so. So, first we've got Idol, our Smoochum Ice Psychic type level 29, relaxed nature, icicle plate uh, being held. Uh, water veil for the ability with the attacks powder snow, powder snow, confusion sing, and heart stamp. Next, we got our gifted Zoroa and Zoroa, dark type, hasty nature, rock head for the ability, cut, faint attack, scary face, and, play, and foul play. Next, we got Guppy the Finion, who has been absolutely amazing. Like, I feel bad about. What I've said about Finneon this entire series, Finneon is awesome. So Finneon, the gu or Guppy the Finneon, level 30, water type, quirky nature, forewarn for the ability with the attacks, water, pus water pulse, attract, safeguard, and gust. Then we got Voltage, the level 30, Zeb Striker, electric type, sassy nature, uh, damp for the ability, so it prevents uh, self-destructing moves uh, with the attacks, uh, shockwave, flame charge, pursuit, and spark. And finally, we have got Arthur. He's having a wonderful kind of day. Level 30, Fracture, Dragon type, Brave Nature. During the grinding montage, I found a Dragon Fang. So that boosts Dragon type moves. I put it on him, which is awesome. Um, steadfast for the ability, Assurance, Dragon Rage, Dragon Claw, and Strength. So we have changed a little bit, but nothing bad happened anyway. So the grinding montage would have been a bit boring. Uh, I am going to try... Oh, it's raining. I'm going to do very quickly. I'm going to speed up and I'm going to get Smoochum and everyone up a level. Because those three Pokemon... Uh, oh, it's a Pad Sage. I can take this out. We can take this out with Idol. Idol can get this. Uh, we are going to have evolutions very soon. Because Idol and Zoroa are one level away from evolving. Okay, it's fine. Uh, one level away from evolving, as is Finneon. So we are going to have all new team we're gonna have like a fully evolved team very very soon kill it now okay i'm gonna just go into the gym and grind because it's gonna be a little bit easier that's gonna give us a lot of experience so we will probably get a jinx today which is awesome we're gonna get a jinx a zoroark and a luminian today hopefully if all things go well we should get those and that's what i want i want to have a powerful team we want to go forward. I want to win this. Also, during the grinding montage, I went and grinded out some wings. Like the muscle wings, the swift wings, the clever wings and stuff. And I just sold them because they are really good for money. Like, really good for money. So, if you ever need money, if you're struggling for money, just go to any of the bridges and just grind out wings. That's what you got to do. <laughs> so, let's go to the gym. Uh, we should be fine. So, how many healing items do I have? We're all around level 30, which is what I want. Uh, we have... We got 30... I, I bought, like, 36 super potions. Uh, a lot of people probably be like, Why not buy hyper potions? I bought super potions because they're cheaper, and I like them. I do like using super potions. So, let's go down. Let's go down here. Let's do this. Let's get our fifth gym badge. I've decided that if we fail any at any point in this episode or so... Because we are at the fifth gym, there is no point me restarting because the fifth gym is like my cutoff point. Fourth gym should actually be my cutoff point for a series. But hopefully we don't lose. Touch wood. Touch wood. We're going to be fine. We're going to be absolutely fine with this. I'm going to battle most of the trainers in here, if not all of them. So let's see what this guy has. I have no idea what any of these guys have. 
Like, I didn't come into the gym and grind. I just did grinding in the grass and I battled all the trainers past. So you got a bronze on. That's a steel. At, okay. I'm getting. It's a steel type. Let's worry about this. A steel and psychic type. We're going to get idle out. We're going to get idle out of there because we don't want idle to uh, fight you. Ooh, oh, Voltage. Voltage has got a fire type move. That's what I need. I just need fire type moves to take out this bronze on. So, Voltage should have this future sight. Oh, I hate future sight. Okay, we got to kill you in like three turns. We're faster than you. We got to kill it in three turns. Otherwise, Voltage is going to die. Okay, we boost speed. Got to get a crit. We got to get a crit. Because that future sight's going to hurt. And Voltage is not the bulkiest mod. I had a lot of close calls with Voltage in the uh, grinding montage. Um, the non-existent grinding montage. Um, and a lot of close calls. Oh, come on, live. I told you. I told you he's not very good. Uh, okay. Um, let's go with Guppy. Let's go with Guppy. Forewarn. Future Sight. Yes, of course. Uh, just going to go for the Water Pulse, and that should kill. Because Guppy is really fast. Guppy is surprisingly fast. Oh, they didn't kill. Please don't kill Guppy. I don't want Guppy to die. Oh, Guppy ate that. Guppy ate it! I'm, 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 it's one of those things. Guppy doesn't look like it should be a strong mon, but it really is. Guppy is freaking awesome. So, almost leveled up from Guppy there. So Guppy needs to get to level 31 to evolve, and Smoochum needs to get to level 30, as does Zorowa. So that's why. But we lost Voltage, which is a little bit bad, but at the same time, I'm not that worried about that. I had like I like Zeb Striker, okay? I really do. But it's not the best mod in the world at all. It's like can't take hits, really. Which is kind of sad. So, let's go and battle this guy. I want to battle as many trainers as possible because I want to have a fully evolved team. Uh, we don't have a full team of six yet, but I don't think... We've only had a full team of six like once this entire series. That's a slow king. So, that's for Zorro to fight. This is a Zorro fight. Hopefully, Zorro can take it. Zorua versus a water pulse. Okay. That's gonna hurt. Okay. Uh, Zorua is so frail. Uh, I'm going into Arthur. I'm going into Arthur because Arthur, I know, can take hits. Arthur can take hits and he can dish him out. Because he's a dragon and Dragon Claw should kill it in one hit, really. Because it's a stab dragon type move. Didn't kill. And we got boosted dragon type attack. So I would have thought that we would have uh, got a kill there. But it's okay. It's fine. Assurance will definitely kill. There we go. Got the kill off on it. Idol is level 30. So we're going to have a Jinx. We definitely got a Jinx. And a Heracross. Okay. Uh, again, that would have been good for Zeb Striker. Um, I'm going to stay in. I'm going to stay in because... Bug and fighting is kind of a problem for me. Chip away. Heracross is really bulky. I need to heal next turn. Definitely need to heal. Yeah, healing this turn. I'm healing because uh, Heracross is a bit scary. Heracross is a scary mon to face. Even if it is only level... Oh my god. Oh yeah, Heracross has got really high attack. Well, my... What am I on about? Heracross has got an amazing attack stat. That's why it like, did so much damage. Heracross is one of the best mons in the game, if I'm honest. I love Heracross. We are faster than it? Yeah, we are. We killed it. Okay. That's what I needed. I just needed to make sure we were faster. There we go. Got the kill. Poison point. Yo, that's a good ability on Heracross. Forget a Heracross. Poison point. Yo, that's so good. I do have uh, pitch berries and stuff, so I can heal. Oh, he's got one more. Oh, Breezel. Okay, we can take him a Breezel. 
Weasel is easy. Weasel is super easy to fight. I thought that was the last Pokemon. I thought that was his, I thought that was this trainer's last Pokemon. So I was like, oh, we can just go on. We'll be fine. And it's like, oh no, you've got one more. Okay. Swift. That's not going to really do a whole lot. Poison is though. Did 10 damage. Let's cure the poison. Okay. Ooh, Petra Berry. Petra Berry. That's what I need. Petra Berry. Aqua Jet. That's going to hurt. Oh, no, it didn't. I keep... Dragon is a type that always confuses me, like, what the resistances are and what they aren't and stuff, so... Dragon Claw, this should definitely kill. I know this is not very good, because I've not leveled up anyone else, really. But we got other battles in this gym to do that with, so it's fine. We're going to have a fully evolved thing. So let's look. Smoochum is evolving. Let's freaking go. Idol is going to become a Jinx. I've never really used Jinx. I... Actually, no, I've never used Jinx. So, this is going to be an interesting thing to do. Oh my god, it's so ugly. <laughs> Let's go, we got Jinx. I am more than happy with having a Jinx. So, Jinx also has a new randomized ability. So, let's have a look and let's have a look at Idol. <clears throat> And you have quick feet, boost speed when there's a stat. Yo! Ooh, with that lowered speed nature, that'd be really useful. And all my attacks, all my attacks but heart stamp are special. That special attack stat, yo. Yo, 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 yo. We got this. We are going to have an amazing team right now. I think the weak link is probably, a lot of people would say, and I'm probably going to say as well, it's probably Luminion. At the same time, having a stab water type user is really good. And considering that Luminion has actually put in the finest of work in this <laughs> on this uh, adventure so far, I'm more than happy with that. So we're going to have Zorua out in front, because Zorua, I think, is the next to a level up. Okay, you've got... 1,400 to go. Oh no, Guppy, 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 Guppy. We're going to have Aluminium before we have a uh, Zoroark, it, it looks like, but that's okay. That is more than okay. I am, that is more than okay. I am more than okay with that. So let's go over here, then up. Up again. Like I said, I want to battle as many trainers as possible. So, even if we get into battles that we shouldn't get into. I want to get into them because I just want to battle trainers and get some more evolutions. I want all of my Pokemon to be fully evolved by the end of this episode. So, uh, Clam Pearl versus Guppy for one. What are you for one of Water Gun. Oh, if it's only got Water Gun. Let's do it. Water Pulse. Get the confusion off. That would be super useful right now. What? See, this is why I love Guppy. This is why Guppy has been coming in clutch. I freaking love Guppy right now. Guppy is not my favorite water type Pokemon. It never will be. But it's getting up there. It's up there. It's a lot better than what I thought it was going to be. Like, just the RNG has been... The RNG gods have been smiling on Guppy. Like, even when we were uh, doing the grinding montage. Even when I was doing the grinding montage. Um... Like, they've been smiling on me. See? Look at that. Not even any damage up on Guppy. So Guppy is going to get the level. There we go. Guppy will evolve after this battle. And then we get in an Omanyte, who is a bit of a pain to fight, but it's okay. Um, what are we going to go into? Let's go into... I don't trust Zor... Oh, okay. I have to stay in. Okay, um, let's go for Water Pulse, I guess. <clears throat> we can't switch out. It has an ability that means we can't switch out. So we've got to kill this thing very fast. And thankfully, Water Pulse is neutral because it is a rock type as well. It's a water rock, so it does neutral damage. Stab rock type moves on this Omanyte aren't actually that scary, to be honest. That's not the scary Omanyte. Sorry, my lord. You are not scary. And we are going to get ourselves a Luminion. I have never used Luminion. Like, this is why 
I was so disappointed with Finion when we first got it. But now look, we got a Luminion. Guppy is coming in clutch. Guppy is a beast. Let's get some Guppy hype in the chat. It's not even, I'm not even streaming. I really should stream more. That's going to be something I'm going to do. I'm going to stream more here on YouTube and try and stream on Twitch again. Um, there we go. We got ourselves a Luminion who is also going to have a randomized ability. So let's have a look at our Luminion. So let's look at it. Let's look at him. Guppy the Luminion. Quirky nature still. Clear body. Preventable stats. But yo. That's so good. That is really good. I'm okay with that. Let's freaking go. And then we got Zoroark just to level up now. We're just going to level up Zoroark once. And we get ourselves a Zoroark. Oh, let's go. Oh, we can't go that way because the thing goes underneath it. Same with that one. Let's go up here. This way. Up again. This way. That's the gym leader. I'm calling it that one. That underneath that pink one is the gym leader. Is there gonna be another trainer? Yes, there is. Right at the end of this corner. Let's do this. Let's get Zoroark up a level, evolve it into a Zoroark, and then we can go and try and face the gym leader. Hopefully, Zoroark won't have anything awful when it evolves. Okay, Snova. It's a bit of a pain. Ice and grass type. Let's do foul play. Oh yes, Zoroark, get in. Go on, Zoroark. Zoro like one shot in it with a with a foul play. Foul play is such a good move. The only problem with foul play, it only works. It only does the amount of damage the uh, the attack style of the other trainer, which is it's really situational. But with a Snova, Snova has really high attack stat, and so that's fine. Okay, you well winded me and clamped me. This is gonna really hurt. Okay, I'm gonna heal this. We're faster. We're faster. There we go. And this is going to get us a Zoroark. We're going to have a Zoroark. Let's go. Another one I've never used. Let's freaking go. I'm okay with a Zoroark. Let's do this. Let's freaking go. Zoroark is evolving. And Zorova... Zorova? Zoroark is going to evolve into a Zoroark. Let's go. Oh, I'm so happy. We have three evolutions in this video. I'm so happy with that. Zoroark is so badass. I love Zoroark's design. I really do. Night Slash, yes, yes. Get rid of Faint. Oh, let's look. So, Night Slash. Off the land's critical hits. It's 95 power. The great. The okay, that could be useful. It never fails to me. I'm never going to use Scary Face. Never going to use Scary Face. Let's go. Night Slash on our Zoroark. So let's have a look at him. Newest member of the team, Zoroark. Quick feet. Okay, another one with quick feet. Jinx and Zoroark both have quick feet. That is really, really cool. I'm okay with that. I'm more than okay with that. So let's heal up Zoroark and Guppy. I wish I could nickname Zoroark. I really do. But unfortunately, you can't because it's an, it's an of ends Pokemon. And if it's one of N's, you can't nickname it, unfortunately, which kind of sucks. Um, let's go this way. And down. And this way. And this way. Not this way, even. Back. That frame rate, yo. This then up here, and this way, this way. Okay, one more trainer. Okay, we haven't found clay yet. Oh, I just realized we're gonna meet Doug again. We gonna meet Doug Dimmerdome again. Let's do this. I'm. I just realized clay is Doug Dimmerdome. Uh, if you missed my Pokemon White series, I named it Doug Dimmerdome. I gave him Doug Dimmerdome's voice. His name is Doug Dimmerdome on the new Dimmerdome. 
And we're going to do that voice again. Let's go. Zoroark versus Whale Lord. Water Pulse. Can Zoroark take hits now? Yes, it can. Kind of. Kind of. Kind of. Kind of take hits. Where he can dish out more hit. It lived. He lived on one. Okay. That's fine. Let's do a cut. Cut. Dead. There we go. Let's go. Oh my god, there's so much experience. Level 31 on Zoroark. Eevee! Let's just back slash it. We should probably kill the Eevee in one hit. I didn't kill it in one hit. Covert. Cut. Cut isn't a great move, but it's fine. There we go. Zoroark is... Oh. Oh. <clears throat> Our team is looking so good right now. The only thing that would make it better is if we still had, if we have a team of six. That's what would make it better. If we still had our Venomoth, that would make this so much better. Because as you know, I love my Venonats and my Venomoths. I love my Poison types. Oop. Oop. Come on. Let's go up. Yeah, that is definitely where Clay is. That is definitely where he is. So I gotta go this way. Now I'm back. I know what I gotta do. I know what I gotta do. I gotta go this way. Up here. again to the side to the side up up here we go this way down down this way This way. Up here. And clay. There he is. Let's get some clay hype up in the chat. We got three mons. Oh, level 31 or 30. I think I'm going to lead this off with Idol. I'm going to lead off with Idol, who is our only girl. Ladies first, so. Hey, give me a wait room, what didn't you, kid? All right, I'm to see what you can do. I'm Doug Dimidome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome, but today my name is Jessica. Let's go, Doug Dimidome, owner of Jessica. Let's go, Doug Dimidome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome. Let's go, Doug Dimidome. And he has an onyx, okay. Uh, that is actually perfect. Is that perfect? Luminion would be better, but we can power the snow? And that should be super effective. And it one shot. Yes, let's go, idle. Let's freaking go. What have you got next? An LGM. That is a psychic type as well. So I'm just going to keep just using idle because idle is our lowest level Pokemon. And hopefully we can get a freeze. Simple beam. So now we have simple for the ability. I don't know what simple does. What does simple do? Impressive! Got that dimming on. What does simple do? Let's have a look. Summary. Okay, it doesn't tell me. Okay. <clears throat> Let's do it again. Guild the Elgium. And a mask. Oh. Oh, we got this. We have got this. This, like, literally Jinx is one shot of this Taijim. Sorry about that. I knocked my desk, and it made the whole thing wobble. Stun spot. Oh, fine. That boosts my speed. You just boost my speed, yo. Okay. 
as his ace is definitely the masquerade. But we got this, guys. I don't see any problems. We have probably, we've got this gym badge in the bag. We've got our fifth badge. Let's freaking go. Let's freak go. He's going to heal. Let's do a sing. Jessica used the hyper potion. She's going to fully heal the masquerade. But we're hopefully going to be paralyzed. Do you know what? I'm going to cure the paralysis. Let's cure the paralysis because I think it's cherry berries. Yeah, cherry berries. I've got enough of these. Gust me. That was a crit. Okay. Um, healing up. Gonna heal up. Heal up, idol. Okay. Another stun spawn. Great. Okay. Um. I want it to go to sleep. There we go. Idol got the sing off. And he made the masquerade fall asleep. I love that their eyes close when they sleep. I love it. I've always loved that about this gem. Like, I just... Oh, I love Gen 5. I love Gen 5 so much. Guys, Gen 5 is definitely my favourite generation of Pokemon. I know I've gone on record before saying Gen 2 is. But just, the more I think about it, Gen 5 is my favourite generation of Pokemon. So... I don't know. There we go. Critical hit from Idol. Idol gets the kill. Idol also gets a level up. So we are all now level 31. Idol, you are awesome. I love this Pokemon so much. I love it. This team is so good. We've got such a good team right now. Really awesome. You got a whip snapper. Keep it on the punch. You got to go. Got another. Take it is. Got no dip it all. Dip it all. Dip it all. Ah, my voice is actually getting a lot better because I've actually done recording. Uh, I'm still a little bit crackly, as you can probably tell, but it's fine. So let's go. We received the Quake badge. That's your badge. Oh, God. Damn, take this. Water gun. Okay. Not the best TM in the world, okay? Let's go. I suppose. Uh, well, I suppose. Come with it. Come this way. Good answers are cruel if we're putting on a good show. Okay, cool. We have to say goodbye to um Bingy now. Because we lost him on. But it's okay. You got the gym badge. I knew you could do it. Yeah, my partners are the reason I got was able to get that badge. And Pokeballs, the stolen Pro Lines feelings will never be with that. Okay. So you do squirts know each other. Are you ready to come with me? I got something to show you. There's always room for folks to grow and change, ain't there? I gotta go to rejecting all thoughts and opinions other than the well-known. They might be dangerous. Hmm. So that one of those comp compromises adults are supposed to make. Whatever. I'm gonna fight Team Plasma. Oh, yeah. What do you want to show us? Well, you heard about the Pokemon World Tournament? Well, you better go down here and do this thing and come down to the end of the town. A tournament? To decide who's the strongest, huh? Right on. Let's go. Okay. Pokemon Mode Tournament. I'm probably going to do that in the next episode, to be honest, because we are about to hit the 30 minute mark. We have done a lot of. I know we just did the gym in this episode, but that gym did take a while because we were grinding out levels. And I just wanted to do that. This is going to be a sort of shorter, slightly shorter episode uh, to what you're used to. Look at our t death box. Damn. And now Zeb Striker joins it. Damn, that's 13 deaths. We got 13 dead mons and no backups. So we got a team of four, but it's okay. We should be fine. I, th I don't know. For the World Tournament, we need three mons. So I'm going to call it an episode, but I'm going to record the next episode directly after this, just so it's done. So I've got all of next week's videos done, so I can go and edit them. And we'll be fine. We'll be dandy. And they'll all be out uh, before you know it. They'll all be out. And hopefully this uh, throat will be better. And we've still got Versus next week as well, which I'm super excited for. Can we buy anything else in here? I'm super excited to do Versus next week. Um, just so you guys know. If you've not been watching the Versus, go and watch it. It's been such a fun series to make with Heart Girl. Um, and I've had a blast making it. And I think I've had a blast editing it, making all the graphics for it, and doing all the stuff for that. That's been amazing. Just as much as this. This is this and that have probably been the best things that have, hap that have happened on this channel over this over the last year. 
basically the growth that the channel had over the first year is amazing. Uh, we are slightly over the first year on this channel, but thank you so much. I, I can't express to you how much you guys mean to me, especially after that sleep block and everything like that. Just all this year has been amazing, like the, my first year on the channel, and I'm going to try and keep being consistent because I love making content for you guys because you guys love it and it, I appreciate it. I appreciate you guys so much. So thank you very much for watching, guys. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe if you are new. And uh, as always, I'm Elite Trainer Hugo. And like I always say, Elite Trainer Hugo is blasting off again!